Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is gonna be me trying out Nikki Tutorials tutorial on the Phantom Mask situations. It is like the album cover for Sean Mendes. I mean we all are we are all Sean we all know who Sean Mendes is, so it's his album cover for his latest album out. I will definitely link her video down below. It's really good. I love her so much. She's such an inspiration to me. And um, she's so amazing. Like, she's such an amazing artist. So what we're going to do first is map out the mask, mask side of it. Taking the... Coppelia or whatever eyeliner and I'm just going to map out the mask situation and the general shape that we're going to have so I'm going to start in like the center of the face it is always in the damn way but I will not But I will not take it off because I will look like a child. It is. Now that we have the general shape of I have here the I have here the master match seven point zero or something. Take like a pump of that on much tanner now because we are getting into yep we are getting into the summer phase it's okay if you mess out of the lines we can clean that up and we can go back in and sort the shape out all over again so this is a real techniques blending blending sponge um, now I'm going in with the Maybelline That's a Cafe Concealer Concealer And I'm just gonna drop this in the eye I haven't used this combination before So I don't know What that's gonna be like Now I'm going to set the face with Cody S1 Oh this is such a good powder but like Oh, incredibly nice. Now I'm just going to set all of that. So I'm just going to dust off the excess powder. Since I can't do anything properly, we have to obviously clean up this situation. But, so I'm going to take the Dove cotton pads. Neutrogena Hydro Boost Cleanser Masala Water Whatever And I'm just gonna Add some to the cotton pad And then I'm going to clean up uh, So I'm starting off with the brows First I'm sorry if I'm not gonna look at the Camera at this point But my brows are pathetic Oh that's a big brow. It's a very, very big brow. But anyway, it's supposed to be a mask, so go now into the gimme brow. And I'm going oh this is a medium deep. Oh. I think I'd have more lid space if I was um using if I did my eyebrows, but yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Use the graffiti treat palette. I'm gonna take the blue shade, this one here, and I'm going to work this in the crease. Oh my god, it's so light that you can't even see it. Wait a sec. I'm gonna pat it. I'm not sure if it's so bright that you can't see it. I'm just going to put this in. We're going to go into the darker blue. We're going to go into this darker blue here. Yeah? I'm 
Now we're going in with the teal shade. Much better. Uh, we're gonna go in with the green, the green here, and we're gonna pack it on into the inner corner. Not inner corner, inner third of the eye. Not a beauty glue. Just gonna pack a little bit more. That green shade is so pigmented compared to the blue. The blue, now we can cut the lid. Concealer. I got the NC45 concealer. Uh, The beauty of this look is that you only have one side to do and I have I just went a little higher because I have a I have hooded set that I have a little bit of the a little bit of black from the uh, other from the other palette that I have and I'm just going to smoke out uh, do a smoky liner I guess a blue like a cobalt kind of blue so I'm gonna take that and I'm gonna smoke the under then I'm gonna smoke the underside of the eye for bronzer I'm using the press powder uh, in chest chestnut and Yardley so now you're obviously not gonna go all the way to the end you're just gonna be bronzing up Hello. Going in with the Kango blush. I'm not sure what the name is. Um, pretty nice blush. I like the power of the makeup in 2.0. The palette that I always use, you can clearly see that it's um, super, super loud. And I'm just going to highlight um, down the bridge of the nose. And I feel like this is the best part of everything. So now I'm going to use the Benetint and the Lush. Start with a kiss. So now that's pretty much done. If you was wondering why I was lining my lips with the black, it's because I don't use personally um, lipstick or I don't use like full makeup like this. I use natural, like not natural. I have like a natural beat because I mean, I don't walk around with full eyeshadow. This is just for the video. So now I'm using this contour palette by NYX and I'm gonna go into like the darker shade and I'm gonna go and start smoking out the edges of the mask City color contour effects and I'm gonna just darken that because I feel like that wasn't as that wasn't as pigmented as I needed it to be so obviously you can see this palette's broken but this one here the
gonna dab into the pressed powder, my face powder, and I'm just going to lightly rub this all around where we blended, just to make it a little bit more thin. Now once we've blended everything out, we're going to um, highlight inside of the mask just to give it that lifted look. So I had fun filming this YouTube video. I hope you guys love this video. Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, go and watch Nikki's video if you haven't watched it already. And guys, I'll mask 